Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a cross, a cross loom bracelet. I haven't tried it out yet, so I'm hoping it will turn out how I want it to do. It's a really good design, so let's get started. You need your arrows facing away from you. You need to get a single border colour. Place from right there. Get another other single. Place it from right there, so it should look like this. Then you're just going to work your, work your way up the board on both sides. I'll see, I'll see you when you, I'm done. Bye. Once you've done it, should it be joined up all the way like this. And you're going to go back to the bottom. Just like that. And then you're going to get one of your cross bands. Place it. Um, like the second on that side to here like that and you can do the same from the first like that to make a cross I'll show you one more then you're going to do the rest by yourself all the way up your loom then second so it's not the one you've just done the one after and it should join up like that and then from there to there I'm just going to work your way all the way up and I'll see you when I'm done bye once you've done it should look like this all the way to the top with your arrows facing away from you so now what you're going to do is at the bottom of your loom your first cross you made, mine was red, you're just going to get a single, place it forwards. And go to the other end, mine was red at the end, so you get a single, place it from right there. And then you, you turn your arrows around so it's facing towards you. Stop it. And then we're going to add a cabin band so you get a single. Loop it once on your finger or your hook. And then you're just going to place it from there to there. And then we're going to loop our border then be done. So you push back all of them. Grab your top black. Place it from there to there. Go back under. Grab your bottom black. Border colour. Place it from there to there. And you're just going to push back all of them. Work your way up your loom like a normal border. I'll see you when I'm done guys. Bye. Once you've looped your border, it should look like this. And then, we're going to just add some extra bands. We're going to go over with red or whatever colour all the way along. Like, I'll show you when I'm done. Sorry guys, but you need to go under, place it under, take it back on. So it should be underneath and then grab it on the other side should be underneath and there and then on top and then just keep working your way up oh wait make sure your arrows are putting the waist to start again I'm sorry guys I'm doing a bit of mistakes here but I know it's going to turn out right so turn your loom around with the arrows facing away from you and then you're going to take this oh you've already done that one <laughs> And then it's already on, so you work your way all the way to the top. I'll see you when I'm done, guys. Bye. When you get to the top, you're just going to take it off and then pull it over and through and then back on so it should. be like that. Now we're going to loop, so make sure your arrows are facing towards you. And then we're going to add another single black band. And then place it like that. Go under all of them. And then you're just going to grab the red band that goes up there and loop all the way in the centre. And I'll see you when I'm done guys. Bye.
once you've got the top you're going to take it off so you just put your through and then take it off i'll see you when i've done that guys bye once you've done that it should look something like this so when you've done we're gonna just do this easy single chain and you will know how to do that so i'll see you when i've done that again bye guys once you've done that when it's facing that way you can easily just turn it around and you can kind of see this the x's here on the back so you can just face it that way and now we're nearly done all we need to do is add an s clip or c clip so you get an s clip or a c clip i'm just gonna get mine and then you join it on to that side and then go on the other side of your bracelet and you might see two bands place it on that side and then we're done see so what it should look like I'll show you what it looks like looks like that thanks for watching guys bye Hello.